down there. Wow. Now this is what I call a laboratory. You are impressed. Impressed, I'll say. Is this a... It is, isn't it? And this... It is. Please, doctor, don't touch anything. Oh, I wouldn't dream of it, your grace. It is grace, by the way, or highness. How does one address an emperor? Politely. <laughs> yes, of course. A doctor, can I ask you something? You expect me to talk? Doctor. Can you assure my friend's safety? They are secure. For now. Then you may ask me anything. Can I ask? Why do you not show fear? Fear? You must know that your likelihood of surviving the next hour is practically zero. Yet you do not seem to be the slightest bit concerned. Oh, Emperor, I am concerned. Of course I am. And yet, well... It's a bit difficult to explain, really. Try. I am... interested. You are? Well, do you know where we've been? We tracked your TARDIS as it returned from another universe. Yes, you did, didn't you? Well, you see, I wasn't quite myself there. They had no concept of time. In fact, they didn't really have linear time, which, as you can imagine, wasn't easy for me. As a Time Lord. Exactly. I'm back, you see. You're proof of that. I'm back in a universe with candy floss, chunky monkey ice cream, cuckoo clocks that work. I'm back in a universe where time exists. I can feel it. I'm back home. Oh, I know the situation's a bit grim, what with you being here. No offence. None taken. But I'm back, I'm home, and I'm me again. Ha-ha! <laughs> I'm a Time Lord. And I finally have some time to lord it over. And that is important. Important? Being, being you, knowing what you are, and being... Well, yes. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs>